Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's play Time Travel Concept Puzzles. Hopefully these will be simple because it is late at night, it's like 1.22am and I can't sleep. Uh, I- for a long time I had a good sleep schedule and then suddenly I- I broke it, and uh, yeah. Funny enough, the way I broke my sleep schedule is by staying up all night designing a map here in Portal 2. Okay, so, let's check out the time travel. I wonder if it's gonna be, like, the same style as Demagepi. Why is the text scrolling so slowly? That's... strange. Maybe it's because I'm limiting the game to 30 FPS. Okay, uh... Oh. Interesting, so it's got, like, an actual cable instead of an ant line. This is, uh... Three. I'm guessing this turns on the, uh... Yeah! So it is Demagepi style. Okay. Uh... Oh, it's double-layered fizzles. Oh, whoa! That's, uh... That's sort of a rendering bug. I don't remember that being an issue in Demagepi's. Um... Okay. Let's just look around. So, where does this... Ah, right. This is very reminiscent of the McGippies. Whatever. <laughs> interesting. So, this is the future, right? How is this going to transition back into the past? Because that wouldn't make sense. This is the past. This is the future. What? That's not how physics works. Oh wait, what? What was I seeing? Oh, I'm not actually looking through the portals. Not two sided like the Megepis. Okay. Yeah, so this is how physics works. Good. Well, uh, I don't think physics actually works this way because of paradoxes and stuff, but, uh... You know what I mean. This is how it makes sense. The... the future does not affect the past. Even though we think that it actually does in real life, the future might actually affect the past. Man, look at this eye candy. This is really detailed work. I like this. Right, so we have to continue here in the future. Oh, and the door closes behind us. Uh, of course. Uh, and here we got another one. Awesome. Whoa! I... I... I didn't even have time to react! I just... Wow. <laughs> the sound in this game is rather strange. Uh, where exactly do they want me to go? Oh, I can do this. Oh no, this is not... not a good idea. Okay. Oh, and there's a... a light bridge that isn't there in the future. Pass, right? What happens if I move one of these in the past? Does it affect the future? There's three... And... How about... Oh! I saw that happen in real time. 
Who's there? Are you still there? Are you? Target lost. So I just moved that guy, but he didn't actually die. And it just completely deletes him. Interesting. Strange. But they did say it was concept puzzles, and you know... We don't actually know how this might actually work. Uh -oh. Um, we want to do this. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, that works. There we go. Oh, there's stuff up there. Interesting. That's probably probably we have to continue in the future. Yep. Yep, the fizzler's broken in the future, exactly what I thought. Ha! <laughs> meant to press the button. Don't need to, though. Interesting. Can I hold this? Ha! This is strange. I mean, not really in terms of portals, not strange at all, but... In terms of time travel, it would be very strange. Ha! Did not see that coming. Oh, is that the end? Oh yeah, that's the end. Cool. Great job, T-Mast. I think this guy helped with Portal Stories Mill. Well guys, thanks for watching. As usual, if you hate the sound of my voice, leave a dislike, it's up to you, and I will see you in the next episode. Goodbye!